Just a month ago, I had 17,000 subscribers, but today I have 200,000 subscribers. I still can't believe it's happening. Hey there, and welcome back to my channel. Since I have a lot of new subscribers, I have to explain what I'm doing here, since most of the people subscribed because of shorts videos, but most of the time I do long videos where I solve puzzles, I uh, show the solution process, I talk through the solution process, uh, telling you my thoughts, uh, what I'm doing, how uh, I'm gonna try to uh, solve the puzzle and so on. So you can watch more than 300 videos that I have on my channel already. I started posting shorts videos recently, but I can't show you some difficult puzzles in a shorts video since I'm limited to 60 seconds of time, but some puzzles requires a lot more time to solve it. For example, this dragon egg uh, puzzle by Smart Eggs. It is extremely difficult. It requires 80 steps to solve it. Smart Eggs website says that it might take days to solve this puzzle. And it's gonna be my first attempt to solve it. The object of this puzzle is gonna be to put this rod inside from the top and navigate through the set of mazes. There are two mazes, one outer maze and the other one is inside. You can move it uh, up, down, you can rotate it and you have to navigate the road through the whole maze and remove it from the bottom. Sounds easy, but until you will start solving it. So if you like this puzzle and you wanna buy it, link is gonna be in the video description. And if you want to see my attempt to solve this extremely difficult Black Dragon Smart Egg puzzle, keep watching the video. So let's try to solve this beautiful and extremely difficult puzzle. I think that I'm gonna take a closer look at it first. What I can see here, I can see two mazes. One is inside on this part and the other is on the outside part. The previous smart egg puzzle that I solved had only one maze on the outer part and there were no inner part, by the way. But this one has two mazes. And as I can see, the mazes are not so difficult. Yeah, they are not very difficult. You can see how the stick will go, but they are gonna be quite a challenge when we have to move the stick through two layers of mazes. It's gonna be a challenge. So I have to stick this stick inside from the top. Yeah, there is a cut out here. Now I have to move the bottom layer, I th or the inner layer, I think. Let's see, if I put it here, then I have to rotate it to the right. Yeah, that's gonna be like this. It goes here, the bottom piece I have to rotate and move the stick all the way down. Oh, it can be moved all the way down and this part can be rotated, then it goes up. Oh, that is interesting. And it is already complicated since I don't really see what to do next. Okay, let's find maybe other ways how to move the stick. I can probably move it somehow to the other side. The stick goes in. I can see it is sticking out from this side. Okay, but there is no exit cut out here that I can put the stick through, so I have to figure out something else. Mm, but that was quite interesting. That means that at some point I can remove it. Oh, there is another way up. Okay, maybe if I can't put it... Oh, maybe this one is on the opposite side. So I have to figure out the way how to move the stick up here. <laughs> Okay, there are two options, either this or this one. But it is not so easy to find the correct one. Because of the inner maze, I can't really see what I'm doing. But I can try to see through the maze and maybe that's gonna help me. Oh, that is interesting. Oh, okay. I found one interesting move, so maybe now I have to move this part somehow inside as well. Let's see if it is possible. I don't think it might be possible now since it doesn't look like the stick is gonna go into this cutout now. 
No, don't think that I can move it. Yeah, it looks like a dead end. I don't want to be stuck here. I want to find another way how to move the, the stick. Since when it is here, I can see that there is... Okay, I can rotate it like this, but then what's happening on this side? On this side, it is stuck. So definitely that is not the option. Okay, maybe I have to move back. Oh, maybe I can even move it all the way down. Oh, that would be nice. That would be very nice if I can move the stick down to this cutout and remove it through another. Oh, okay, this is possible. And probably now I will be able to move the stick around. Ooh, okay. Uh, but it feels like it is not enough, just a little bit to fit it through this hole. Maybe it can go all the way up now. No. Oh, that is tricky. That is tricky since that looks like another dead end. But no, 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 no. That can be a dead end. It has to be a way out. I want it to be a way out. Oh, I can skip some parts of the maze just by moving the rod somewhere between the layers or something like that. That looks kind of cool. But I don't know where to move it now. And again, it sticks out from this cutout. Oh, what to do next? The trick is hidden somewhere between these two cutouts, but I don't know what to do. I don't know which one to use. And I can probably easily move between these cutouts. Yeah, I found the trick already. But what's next? What is gonna be the next move? What? How I was able to do that? Oh, probably there is a part of the inner maze where I can't move the rod all the way here, but on the other part I can do that. Oh, that is interesting. Okay, let's keep doing let's keep solving it and see what else i can do the the stick is right here now i have to move it to another spot i have no idea where i have to move it now but definitely not to this place i have to move it to another one i can probably move it inside the inner maze let's see if it is possible like on the other side to skip some parts of the maze. Oh, I think it went inside. What is gonna be, oh, oh, and it sticks out on the other side. Okay, so what is gonna be the next move? I guess maybe, oh, yet yeah, it goes inside. What's next? I think that I have to move it to another spot, I don't know where. Maybe maybe to the top, maybe to the top part, let's see. I know the trick already, how to move it there. I need just to figure out how to do that from the new spot. Probably like this. Oh, that goes this way. And please, oh yeah. Ooh. Definitely I have to get out of this spot since there is only one cutout here and I have to move somewhere else. Okay, now the next move. The next move will be to move the rod here. Okay, it goes up and probably to this cutout. Okay, the next one. Oh, the next one is here. That is interesting. I can rotate it right here. And it goes out of this hole. Okay. 
and what's gonna be the next move? It feels like it is not possible to move it here since the stick is gonna stuck there. So probably this is not the right one, but I've made a huge progress and that's very good. That's very good. Oh, maybe I just have to put it inside. And now move it somehow here. Oh, that was a huge move. Now I have to do something with the enemies, I think. What to do with it? How to move the rod so that it goes... Hey, hey, I came back. No, oh, oh, that is another one. That is much closer to the finish. Okay, I can move the rod a little bit, maybe down here. Oh, that's nice. And that would be nice if I can put it somewhere here. But if I want to put it to this cutout, how to do that? Where the rod supposed to be so that I can move it there? Probably on this side or maybe even on top. Oh, that is gonna be a challenge. Maybe I have to go back in order to move forward. What's next? Maybe I can move it down. Oh, no way. I can move it here. Oh, wow. And I, I, th that's like a couple of steps. There is just a couple of steps. What to do next? I have to move it to the opposite side somehow. This way. Uh, I don't see if it is possible to do now. There are two cutouts here, which I can probably use. Yep, I can use this one. Uh, but what's next? I can't stick it out. Oh, okay, so maybe I have to use another one. Maybe this one, no. Uh, something is wrong here. I have to find a way how to move the rod all the way out from the other side. Okay, I can see that I have to use this cutout, but I don't know how to reach there since it feels like it goes down here, but then maybe it is something wrong with the maze inside, since it feels like one, one of these parts, one of the parts of the maze is right on the way and doesn't let me go in, but it feels like that it's supposed to go there. Maybe like this, I will find the correct spot. Oh! Oh, finally! Done! That was quite a difficult puzzle. It took me a lot of time to solve it, but much less time than it was written on the SmartX website. They say it may take days to solve it. It took me just 40 minutes, but I feel that I could solve it in 30 minutes, since the last 10 minutes I spent to figure out the way how to remove the rod from the bottom part of the maze. And uh, I spent it because I didn't want to make any for forcing moves and I had to do it to remove the rod, since it wasn't easy to uh, move it through this cutout and it doesn't feel right. Let me know if you ever solved the Black Dragon puzzle and you had to uh, do this forcing move in order to remove the rod since it doesn't feel right but I think it is the way how you solve this puzzle. So great one, very difficult, it is still quite difficult for me to understand what has happened inside, how I was able to move the rod in some of the parts. Probably I'm gonna resolve it a couple of times after filming this video and maybe um, I will be able to solve it much quicker since you can speed solve this puzzle. There is a sign here which says speed solving and I think that I saw videos uh, online where people solve this uh, egg in just like 
30 or 40 seconds, something like that. But that is not solving, that is just repeating the solution which they already know and which they just know how to uh, do very quick. So great puzzle, very nice and beautiful puzzle, which is gonna look nice on everybody's uh, puzzle shelf. And if you like it and you wanna buy it, link is gonna be in the video description. And if you enjoyed watching my video, hit the like button, subscribe, and see you in my next video.